Hey everyone. Um, I just wanted to finally unbox a bunch of Amiibo that I've been really lazy about unboxing. And I'm going to start with the Breath of the Wild Amiibo. Uh, right. We'll start with a giant guardian. So here's the guardian in the box. There's the back of the box. And uh, this, this is how wide the box is. Open it up. Take out the guardian. Now this thing's really cool. How'd they make that so difficult? It was way more difficult than it needed to be. But here is the Guardian Amiibo. Here's the back of them. Here's the front. And what's cool about this Amiibo is all the legs are posable. And they don't feel like they're going to rip off or anything. So everything's really well made. Uh, all the detail on it is really nice. It's a really good amiibo. I like it. All the legs are posable. Put them in crazy things. I wonder if you could stand on them. That he can. You can stand on him. That's cool. It's like having a guardian action figure. All right, next, next up, next, 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 next. We got Rider Link or Link Rider in a more traditional. Amiibo box. Ami box. It's a me box. Okay, so here we go. Uh, let's uh, do that. So here is the Rider Link Amiibo. He's on a black horse. It's not a Pona because the Pona's got white hair. And if we go. Up close and poisonal. Not that as close as I thought it would. Anyway. Yeah, so here's Rider Link. I wish autofocus worked on this. It'd be so amazing. But that's not my luck, is it? That is not my luck. So he's really detailed. He's got the Sheikah Slate right there. He's got a uh, wooden shield. He's got his cape thing, which I have in the game. I don't have his blue tunic yet. I'll get it eventually, I, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's cool. All right. Bokoblin. It's the back of the box. This is what you get if you scan him. loud. Alright, here's the vocabulary. Let me take a look. It's amazing how they get like the paint job really like nice looking. I think it's amazing. Got a Boko Club. Like, everything's so tech like detailed. It's his butt. Yeah, he's a good one too. I got a bunch to go through, so I'm
Anyway, so here's what's on the back of that one of the Archer. Oh no, it's got twisties. It's my least favorite thing when it comes to figures. Why well, you gotta do that, Nintenders? So, here. He's gonna shoot ya. Wow, that's really detailed. This is probably the best looking one out of all of them. I love this. It's not just on a, like a, a piece of plastic. He actually like did something stylized with it. That's really nice. He's got the same shield as he did on the rider link. Probably the same sword too. Normal bow with no string because it's probably really hard to do. I haven't gotten to that arrow yet, but I'm assuming it's called a guardian arrow. Yeah, that's really nice. I really like that. All right. The last one is Zelda. Now it doesn't say princess on here, it just says Zelda. But uh, you get that uh, hero sh shield or something like that. I don't remember exactly what it's called. There's something along those lines. And here she is. Here is what's going on with her eye. So her eyes looked weird, but her eyes are just fine. It's just the angle. So she's a lot less involved, so I could probably get this a little closer. There we go. So this is Zelda. She has some sort of Sheikah tablet in her hand, which I'm assuming is a spoiler that I haven't gotten to yet. So one day I'll figure out what that is. But here she is. I like her boots. Boots are nice. And her uh, her satchel right here. And her uh, hair. Her hair's nice. Yeah. So that's Zelda. So now I got the anniversary Zelda ones. I got Toon Link and Princess Zelda. Here's the back. Alright, let's start with Toon Link. There he is, and he's playing with his Wind Waker over there. Everything's so detailed on these things. It's fantastic. He's really good detail. Wind Waker's a little thick, but I guess they had to do that. And here's Princess Zelda. Oh. Also, very detailed. I mean, the Wind Waker ones can only get so detailed. But, like, even... Even this little piece right here. It's like... I'm assuming it's a sticker. But it's not very crooked at all. Did a very, very good job. Right? 8-bit link. This one's super cool. Oh, he's got a sword on his, on his back, too. I didn't know that. So, 
here he is. Sideways. This is like so weird. In the back. And the other side. So cool though. But I just want to pull apart all these layers. Is that a Minecraft sword? They use like Minecraft. Yeah, I know, it's 8 bit. I think. No, the shield's fine. So here is a. Right, so he's cool. His uh, arms a little, a little huge. If you ask me, but uh, it's fine. All right, and my favorite one of the bunch, Ocarina of Time Link. Can't believe I waited so long to open these. I've had these for months. I've just been so lazy. Alright, let's take a look at this. Oh my god. He is so detailed. This is ridiculous. This is so good. I don't see any problems with the paint. So one little problem with the paint, right there, but you can't see it when you're just looking at him. Oh man, this is so good. I can't believe how like amazing this one is. The Master Sword looks great. Hylian Shield looks great. The sheath looks great. Ocarina looks great. So good. Alright, three more. These are Smash Brothers ones that I finally found. Got Robin. Here's Robin. Ooh, you can read his book. Very nice, very nice. Let's read his book. Do it actually have words? I wonder if it does. No, they're just lines. Lines and dots. It'd be funny if they were actually really small printed words. But there's Robin and his pirate glory. It's a cool sword. Squishy, squishy. All right. I finally got the deal. Pit. Now I just need dark pit. So here's pit. Now the real thing is, do I have space for all of these? See, and then they did that, like, this stupid thing. Instead of figuring out some better way. Ugh, oh, excuse me. There's wings, the back. Oh, getting a little off-centered there. Swords are cool, too. That has a lot more detail than it looked like. Huh. Sweet. And I finally found this.
Here's Ness. I had Lucas. Now I finally have Ness. Like, Amiibo are just so cool. People bash on Amiibo for being, like, things locked behind paywalls. But if you're a fan, these things are the best. Because they're just, like, small little collectibles that are only, like, 12 bucks. And they give you extra stuff in games if you want to use it. Like, so I got all these, and then I also have all of those. I got a lot of Amiibo. Lots of Amiibo. Lots of Amiibo. So yeah. If you haven't picked up any of these Amiibo yet, I say get on it. They're all really cool. Um, this one especially. This one's also, I think, a must-have. Yeah, those are my two favorite. I mean, the Guardian's really cool. So, yeah, you'll see me next time.